Thanks for tuning in to Shaw Arts and Entertainment. I'm Curtis Anderson back at the Spadina Free House today, talking to some of the members of local band Hurricane Cletus. Up first, Mr. Greg Dick. Greg, how are you doing today? Good, yourself? I'm doing fantastic. Thank you for asking. Things happening for Hurricane Cletus. Before we talk about 2007 and all the things that are about to happen for you guys, all the things on the horizon, take us back to 2006. I understand it was a spectacular year for you guys in the band. Yeah, it was great. We. Uh we just formed in the winter of 2006 and joined the uh, Roxy Band Wars mm -hmm. and we came out of that on top and uh, since then we've just had a string of good luck I guess. Good luck indeed. You didn't mention it. You won the Canadian Radio Star Songwriting Competition for the Hurricane Cletus song Stained. Take us through that. Stained? Oh, I, I wrote that last winter. Um, yeah. It was... I, I came up with the initial idea and stuff but the band sort of like we do with all of our songs, we collaborate on every, everything, so they deserve a lot of credit too. They, they did a lot of the arranging and stuff like that. So, What do you attribute the success of the band to? I mean, you guys have been together a relatively short period of time, but you guys have you know, really made a name for yourself locally. Uh, you know what, the chemistry, we have a lot of fun together. It's five guys. We started this just having fun, and that, that things are happening for us is just sort of a bonus. We're still having fun, and that's, that's the number one priority, I guess. Actually, the guys from Hague, they've been together for a long time. Well, of course, they're brothers, so they kind of grew up in that scene. JK and myself were brought in a little later just to fill things out for the album. And, you know, I played a couple of gigs with them before, and I don't remember a lot of the time I spent with them because it was a lot of fun, but we won't go into depth with that. But, um, yeah, no, everything just kind of clicks. We're a really good unit. It's almost like playing with your family, so it's really good. Talk about the music scene here in Saskatoon, like I mentioned to the other guy, you guys have done a lot in just over a year. Is that a reflection on, is, is, is the talent in Saskatoon right now, you know, kind of at a low that you guys really stand out? Because I don't think that's the truth. I know a lot of talented bands, but you guys seem to have, you know, really excelled in the last year. Yeah, well, I think us, as well as many other of those talented bands out there, would say we're the luckiest SOBs that you could actually come across. It's just been a roller coaster. Uh, one thing chains into another, chains into another, and really it's, it's all a timing thing and, and luck. Like, nothing taken away from the band. They're a great band, but uh, there's a lot of really good talent out there, and I still like to go out and see them too. So. No one inside to hold you at night. Still shaking your hips until you're not lost flaming The inspiration is as loud as we can be and uh, pretty much just in your face like anytime we play it's we're gonna have a party we're gonna have a good time and hey you know jump on the bus and join along I guess first off did it ever you know get volatile playing with your brother I can I can only imagine very volatile yeah. no no not really once in a while there's been stuff wrecked in the in the past yeah but generally we get along we fight, and like brothers, we make up, so. <laughs> what are people going to see if they take in a Hurricane Cletus show? Uh, a lot of energy, most of the time. Just straight up rock and roll, and you're just trying to entertain the crowd and give them something to watch. Explain your popularity overseas. I'm reading here, you guys are getting a ton of airplay in, like, Japan and Germany and the UK. Uh, there's been definitely some interest there. Um, Japan, we are just um, been put on cell phones in Japan for people to download our songs and it's a pilot program they have for indie bands um, so we're on that um, and yeah Germany and UK a lot of magazines and promoters have been contacting us who want to do articles or play our music so it's we'll see where it goes it's all at the start but yeah it's cool and heading to Toronto it says yes on March 9th I believe oh, what's going on there um, we're showcasing stained at the uh, Canadian Music Week all right, Greg, explain a little bit of how the national winner is determined. I guess there's probably a voting process or something. You want to shout out to the people of Saskatoon, maybe uh, get some help going here? Yeah, basically, if anyone's interested, uh, you can vote on radiostar.ca, and it'll be under Greg Dick, Stained. Um, yeah, and as well, there is a judging panel as well that determines, I think it's half and half voting. Are there clips or music clips on your MySpace where people can uh, check out Stained before they vote? And yes, there is. We've got four uh, songs on, currently on MySpace. And you can also check, us, check some of the songs out at hurricanecletus.com.